Thank you very much. On behalf of NORAD's evaluation department, it is my pleasure to welcome you all to this seminar. I won't go much into the background for this evaluation. As you, I'm sure you're well aware, uh, Norway's initi initi International Climate and Forest, uh, Forest Initiative was launched by the former Prime Minister Stoltenberg uh, about uh, a, a few years ago, in 2007 to be quite exact. A new government came into place and they expressed their continued support to this initiative up till 2020. And needless to say, this is a very large initiative. Uh, up to 5 billion kroners has been pledged on an annual basis. So therefore, we as an evaluation department saw this as an opportunity to launch a real-time evaluation in 2010. A consortium led by LTS International, together with Indofor, Ecometrica, and Christian Mikkelsen Institute, have therefore conducted several evaluations throughout this time period. And today's seminar has a dual purpose. It's first of all to learn about the results so far, with the big question, what has the initiative actually achieved? And the second purpose is to discuss the implications for the way forward. And this is what we like about these open seminars, that we get an opportunity to ask questions and uh, provide comments. So the agenda is basically as follows. There will be a presentation of the main findings and conclusions before continuing with some comments from, by representatives, both from the initiative, from NORAD, as well as academia. And then we will open for questions and hopefully we'll have a good and fruitful debate. My dear colleague, Ida Helmark, will be facilitating the discussion as such, so she will help guide us through this seminar. Let me just add also that the seminar is being streamed. Live, there's live streaming, so this actually sort of, yeah, let us know that we should all use microphones, uh, and please introduce yourselves when you have questions as well. With further ado then, it's my pleasure to introduce Pat Hardcastle, Dr. Hardcastle, who's been the overall team leader, and I think we're just all key now to get a presentation of con conclusions and recommendations from this evaluation that's been conducted. Thank you very much.